about my channel. Happy Valentine's Day, actually. I should say Happy Independence Day, Happy Valentine's Day. I just finished up a weekly vlog and I'm deciding to start another one because this is going to be such a fun week. It's going to be a hectic, crazy week because it is a big lit reveal week for my sorority. I'm so excited because I'm going to find my little this week and she's going to join the family along with my twin and her little. So it's going to be really fun. We have a lot of plans regarding getting the outfits ready for big little and getting all the baskets ready and everything. It's currently Sunday and I got my little yesterday. Tomorrow's our first basket and usually the first basket is always a food basket. I got a list of the different things that she likes. So I'm gonna go and pick up that from like CVS. I was so overwhelmed in there with what I got. So I just like literally picked up a bunch of random stuff. I got a good amount of good stuff for her. So I'll show you guys all of that when I get home. I got my photos developed. Oh my God, these are gonna be, <laughs> these are so cutie. These are the snow ones, look how cutie. Oh, this was the first snowball fight. Oh wait, this is my camera when I went to Florida. Now we're gonna go home. I got her these two fluffy socks, which are really soft. And then I got her Sour Patch Watermelon, Sour Patch Kids regular ones, gummy bears, regular lemonade, pink lemonade, dark chocolate, another Hershey's dark chocolate, some Reese's, and then Cheez-Its. And then I saw these because she likes Reese's, but I thought these were fun. I think I'm going to go put some little earrings in here and then some little stuffers at the bottom to, you know, raise it up a little bit. I already showed you guys a little bit about all of that, but I feel like it's such a fun week and I want to show you guys like how I'm doing all of it because I know it could help you guys in the future if you guys are going to have to go through big lit and like get stuff for your littles it's like six o'clock now currently i'm working on a comm project that i have for one of my classes it's for visual media we have a project that we had to take 10 pictures throughout the day with like a dslr camera or a film camera basically give like a story behind the picture and it all has to be within the same day i'm working on that right now within photoshop and it's valentine's day and so i treated myself and i ordered sushi i think that might be my food okay that's my food Good morning everyone, happy Monday. I am starting the morning off bright and early. Time for a little rundown of what we are going to be doing today. It is around 8 a.m. right now. I just got up, cleaned my room, and got myself together for the day. I'm probably gonna put on a little bit of makeup today just to make myself feel better and feel a little bit more productive. Last night, I just pretty much finished up my project that I had to do and turn in this morning. Today, we are gonna go to the library around 9.30, 10. We're gonna grind out a lot of work today, get some stuff done for AKO, get some stuff done for schoolwork this week, and projects that I have to do. Also got randomly selected to do the COVID testing for tech. So I have my test today at 11, but you guys know I already got a test on Thursday of last week and that came back negative. So we're COVID free over here, guys. I already know my test is gonna be negative again, unless something changed over the weekend, which I didn't go anywhere over the weekend. I have a Zoom meeting with one of my advisors today at 2.30. I have an exec meeting tonight at seven, but it's just gonna be a very productive Monday. Also today is very gloomy and it's gonna be raining a lot this week. So it's already gonna put my mindset down a lot. We're gonna do our best to keep ourselves in track and stay productive this week. I'm currently just looking like this. I'm wearing this sweatshirt from White Fox Boutique and then some Lulu leggings. Then we're gonna probably put on some Air Forces. <laughs> We decided to pick up some lunch from campus, so I just got a salad from Soup Garden at Turner's. It's really good. At 2.20, I have a transitional advising meeting because I switched majors, so I need to go on that. Basically, just going through my graduation worksheet and making sure I'm on like the right track on what classes I need to take and still need to complete and stuff like that. So I have a meeting with her in like four minutes, and then after that, I need to finish up the rest of my stuffers for my basket, and Erin's at the store right now picking up a few things for me. Look how cutie, so I put the little socks right here, and and her name is Hannah, guys. I wrote her a little note on the back of it. I'm going to drop this off at Sarah's house right now. I was on campus today and this thing was like too low, so I picked up bags of chips and literally stuffed them at the bottom. So those are like little stuffers down there. But I wanted to pop in here and say thank you to Case of I for sponsoring today's video. Have a new one on my phone right now. They were awesome and sent me over a few new phone cases for this year and I'm so excited. They are one of the most stylish, cutest, most protective phone case companies.
Tiffany's out there. This one is one of their signature prints, which I love because you can see the bone color in the back. It has little white clouds over it and it's very simple. So since this is a sorority themed video, I'm going to show you guys the custom phone case that I made for my sorority. And I love it. You guys know I made one of these last year and so now it's time to upgrade that bad boy. Cases that I made and it says AKO all over it. Corners of it has little bumpers because this is one of their like ultra impact cases. Basically this means it offers extreme protection to your phone at all times. And so you know if you're clumsy like me and you drop your phone all the time, then you know you'll be protected with Caseify. And the impact cases are engineered with a two layer construction of Chi Tech. Caseify offers so many different designs that you are bound to find one that fits your style. So you get the best of both worlds because you get protection with personality. All cases from Caseify have an antimicrobial coating that keeps your phone case germ free, killing 99% of the bacteria. And they're also made with partially recycled plastic so you can feel good about your phone looking great. Now that I showed you guys my cute new cases, I am going to do a drop test for you guys. As you can see, my phone is turning on, off. Here is my phone and we are going to drop this. And there we go. She's still working just fine. Here's the camera. So you guys should go to casefiat.com slash Maya to get 20% off of your phone case today. Good morning. It is Tuesday and it's 8 a.m. I just made myself a cup of coffee and I just cleaned my room. We are sitting at my desk. I have an assignment due at 9.30 and I was just way too busy yesterday. So I'm gonna draft that up and turn it in before it's due. And then I have a class at 9.30. And then after that, I have a group project that I need to start working on. The first part of it's due tonight at midnight. So I'm gonna do that. And then probably finish stuff for my second bath basket which is a pink theme today so I'm gonna show you guys that I kind of drafted it up like really late last night around 11 I had to last minute like trade shirts with my twin I kind of made an idea of what I want my basket to look like today but I might switch it around I also need to make a few more canvases I also have composites today my hair and my makeup i just went and actually picked up my brother's car because he's letting me use that for the day and i had to go pick up some basket stuff so i'm going to show you guys the basket that i'm doing today this is like a pink theme so i will show you guys the stuff that i have for it this is the basket that i did have for the pink theme but i think i'm going to switch it into this basket because that goes with the pink theme and i'm going to save this one for the neutral like black and white theme so we're going to move everything into this which is this is a lot smaller <laughs> Number two, we have this little sweatshirt. We have little candy in here, some stickers, jewelry, a little notebook, and then I made this fun little poster in here. It's out the tie. So I'm currently on the way to pick up Emily. I stopped at Mill Mountain on the way, and I got an iced coffee. I actually really like their iced coffees. Support local if you can, but I got some Mill Mountain to keep me feeling for the day because I got a lot of stuff to do. So me and Sarah also just got off FaceTime because we're trying to figure out what we're gonna do for these basket deliveries because we're very restricted on the things we're allowed to do, but we still want to make it fun. On the way to pick up Emily now, and I will see you guys when probably not when we're at the house because I get too nervous, but later after. Okay, so right now I'm at Emily's. <laughs> <laughs> what? Why are you laughing at me? <laughs> I just picked up her roommate Maddie and dropped her off at class and then The yep. speed you're talking is like the speed your life is going <laughs> It really is. <laughs> this has literally been me the past like two months. I swear I'm never like stopping. Like, okay, we're going to do this and then we just pick up this and then we're going to do this. I'm such a mess right now. Today has been like the most chaotic, like all over the place day. I really thought after the like, like when I came home, I was like, okay, I'm done. I can just chill for the rest I of the day. Just... Then Maddie calls me and she's like, can you take me to class? And I'm like, yeah. And then Sarah's like, can you drop off the baskets now? And I was like, yeah. <laughs> and then Riley texted me and he was like, can we go home right now? And I'm like, yeah. But anyways, Anywho. Emily is being amazing and she's making my big little shirts for little reveal day. We're doing Bratz theme, so she's currently printing out the crickets right now. You so can't really see it, oh. but like this is what it's gonna look like. It's like, like here I mirror it. Big little we're doing G big all of that and this is her little cricket she's working her magic right there these are the shirts that I'm using Emily's shirts she's doing finding Nemo so it's like finding Biggie anyway, so, uh, <laughs> but my brother just texted me and he's like I think 
I need to go home like right now for some project thing and I was like today like right now It's four o'clock and we live five hours away, but okay and we can do that And I was like, you know, what? I might as well go with him because I need to get my car My car had to get serviced before I came back to school Then it wasn't serviced in time and I had to come back for rush I had to leave my car there. So this semester I haven't had a car with me here simply. in Blacksburg. What'd you say? I said to put it simply. Yeah, to put it simply I have not had a car and that has been making my life ten times more stressful So when he said I'm going home, I said I'm taking that even though literally I have to deliver a basket tomorrow I'm just like a big mess right now, but it's okay. We're gonna get through this and Emily is here to keep me sane Yes, I am. She really is even though I'm insane as well <laughs> Hello all. I'm currently on the way home. We're at a gas station. My brother left around five o'clock to leave Blacksburg and come here. On our road trip to Virginia Beach, we're just passing Sun and we're at a gas station getting gas and I just got a banana and some snacks and we will be at home around 11 o'clock tonight. Hi guys, today is Wednesday and it's around, it's almost noon now and I'm currently on the way back to school guys. I got home last night at like 10.30 and I am two hours away from school now. I woke up this morning at like 7.30, showered, got a few things that I wanted to bring back to school, and then put my baskets together, which are back there, and I'm gonna show you guys these after. I actually love them. So I have my tech basket, which I'm gonna give her today, and then this is the big little reveal basket. So my girl actually is, is an informal girl. We have not met each other yet. We're both from Virginia Beach. It's been so much fun like getting to like know this girl when like we don't even know each other yet. Like she seems so sweet, and like I cannot wait to meet her, and I hope she's excited too. I'm gonna get to school around two o'clock, and then me and Bella made a nail appointment because my nails are very grown out and we're gonna go get our nails done at the nail bar at three. done this is what they look like these are just acrylic gel nails i got them very short and like natural because it's just easier to work with i really like these today's a tech theme basket and i just used a clear bucket but i thought it was cute because you can see all the different shirts i don't know what this lighting is i'm sorry guys i put a little hokey blanket in here Whole video is pretty much based around sorority life and big little reveal reveal day themes and i know it can be like very stressful for a lot of people finding all the stuff to give to baskets because clearly like it can be very expensive it's a lot of stuff to be giving away but honestly a lot of this stuff is what you get every year if you go through the process yourself you are going to be a little at some point so your big is going to be handing down all of these like t-shirts from previous years to you i know it looks like a lot of stuff but if we're gonna be honest a lot of the stuff is from like 2000 2008 2010 like it's super super old but that's like the whole part of like the tradition you're getting passed down stuff and you can kind of see from like where it started to where it's at now and it's really cool so i already had a lot of stuff from my previous years but obviously you can add on to that by getting baskets and decorations what i want to talk about is the sorority shop and they were nice enough to send me a little pr package filled with a kayo stuff and you can get big little reveal day outfits from them sorority merch and they have it for like all different sororities i opened up this little box literally this is not sponsored at all they were just nice enough to send me this stuff. So the first thing is these stickers. They literally just have tons of different AKO signs on them, which I thought was really cool. The wallet pocket for the back of your iPhone, and it says Afkai Mega on the bottom of it. And then we've also got an AKO pop socket, AKO keychain, which is so fun. You can put this on your backpack, on your keys, on anything. No way, this is actually really cool. So this is a sorority AKO flag. I'm pretty sure it's gonna look like that. Three by five. And then we have this little blanket, which honestly would be really fun to use in the summertime especially because i live at the beach towel kind of blanket and it says alpha Chi omega like on the center of it so that is so fun this is the last thing that was in the box color changing cups and it comes with all the straws and then these are just like the different ones i guess turns colors too so these are just again like i said they're really fun just basket stuffers and little fun things to give to your littles and your families and stuff so if you guys are interested in checking them out i'll leave them down below and i think if they give me like a discount code or like a referral code or something i'll leave that down below yeah. we're doing our sneaky drop off <laughs> um, so we're having them go drop off the basket there they go and they're gonna put them oh my god <laughs> they're gonna go put these on the pylons right now oh my god it's so pretty but i want to get a video of her like yeah we're gonna watch wait her. no they're going too far i can't see them <laughs> 
picture of the vlog my outfit. <laughs> oh, wait, I look like like a homeless man. Vlog? I'm wearing yeah. plaid on plaid. <laughs> it's so cold out, but it's gonna snow, guys. We have a snow day tomorrow. Oh. So exciting. <laughs> Did you see the aerosol? <laughs> Taco salad and a green smoothie. Yeah. Yummy. And we are all back at the apartment now. Taylor and Aaron are making spaghetti tacos for dinner. Aaron is on the way home with Abby from the hospital, and oh. Lily's doing an assignment. Tonight, we're supposed to get a lot of snow, plus like a lot of ice. They canceled all classes for tomorrow, which is they've never done before. So it's also big lit tomorrow, and that is canceled. Katie just got her basket delivered. Yeah. Ooh, I have some Japanese cherry blossoms. It is. I have, I've never had a squishmallow before. Oh, those are cute. Oh, oh, I like that. She came to the rescue. Does this happen to anyone else, or is it just me? Nothing's coming. I'll be the princess. Let me come enjoy it. It is currently a Saturday. No, I'm just kidding. Oh my god, wait. Today's Friday. Wow. No. Is today Thursday? Yeah. Dude, you're having your days fucked up. I know, I really do. <laughs> today's Thursday. It's messing me up because we had a snow day today and they canceled all online and in person classes because it's snowing. You guys want to see? It really, like, literally isn't even that bad. This is nothing compared to what we've had before, but it was, like, really icy, I guess. That is why they canceled classes, just because it's dangerous to be driving on the road. We took the snow day. I edited in a video the whole day. I got some stuff done um, and I was productive. So that's that. And I'm wearing this little outfit. Me and my friends are going to go get Cabo for dinner and I'm very excited. And we're going to hang out there. This is the fit. It's a Princess Polly puffer and then this bodysuit from Express, which is like open in the back. And then these jeans, Princess Polly, and then my Air Force Ones. And we will see you guys at Cabo. <laughs> Can you tell I just self tan so this is not what it's supposed to look like it's developing and then I'm supposed to wash it off in like 30 minutes so just bear with me I'm gonna put my laundry away because I just did this and then I cleaned my room this morning me and Taylor got Duncan we got some coffee I'm about to upload a video and then I'm gonna start getting ready for a big little reveal I'm so excited I literally can't wait to meet her and then go to dinner and stuff pretty sure we're all gonna go to Lane Stadium and like park our cars outside <laughs> to deliver my basket for her right now. Oh my God, they're the best. This has literally been the most chaotic day. It's already three o'clock and I still have my fake tan all over me and I need to shower and still get ready and I need to meet my girl for my reveal in like an hour. I wasn't planning on giving her a basket right now, but like I was, I'm so all over the place, guys. I'm a mess. Taylor is being an angel and delivering it for me. But I picked up my, my shirts and I put her shirt in there because I wanted her to wear that to the reveal and kind of go with what she wants with it. This is the shirt and then I have a skirt that I'm gonna wear with it and then just dropped off all the stuff at my twins apartment. And we also have the wrapping paper back here, which I just put in her thing and she's gonna look for that color on my car So very excited stressed out. I'm gonna go home and see you there I took a shower and then curled my hair and then put these little scrunchies in and I self tanned and I did my makeup everything We have this little necklace I got some for the rest of the girls and then these are our t-shirts They say big little on them and then I'm wearing this little skirt It's currently like a really icy and snowy out But this is the fit this skirt I literally just got for like 10 bucks off Amazon an angel and she made these shirts for us so actually gonna bring them these necklaces because I got some for them and then these scrunchies too. So do you guys like this? My new screensaver. Nothing matters because it really doesn't. So hi guys. Hi. So we're currently in the back of my car. This is what we've got going on. We blew up some balloons and we have the wrapping paper right there. They're doing reveals over there. We just texted our girls. Hopefully they find us okay. Lauren, we miss you. Lauren, <laughs> love you. Yes. And um, Tate. And Tate, yeah, I know. Shout oh my god. Our family. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can feel it like the race 
from the sun, you bring the sunshine I can feel it That you are the one, oh baby, be mine I can feel it